Good morning, America. And those who, of course, is not in the United States, you probably have seen these videos, hopefully. Um, I just want to start off saying by saying, well, good Sunday morning. I hope you all are having a great day so far. And I just want to say, uh, happened to see something where ISIS was in Indiana. Yes, they're everywhere else too, but I live in Indiana. So this touches a little bit closer to home. So, uh, I just want to say, for you that's in Indiana and those surrounding states and so forth out, what's it going to take for you to understand that ISIS is no good? How much is it going to take for you to stand against them? Yes, I get it. They have the right for their freedom of religion. Freedom of speech, I get it. But when they start shooting us, Americans, then it's time to do something about it. I believe it was like something like two dead, seven, no, two dead, 11 wounded in Indianapolis, our capital. And they were all by ISIS. ISIS on that all. Is it going to take for some ISIS member or ISIS follower to come up, knock on your door, blast your child, and kill them, or your spouse, or who knows, it might be your kid who answers the door, it's time to go answer it. Next thing you know, is you hear a gunshot, and you see their brain splatter against the wall. Come on, people, wake up. I may be young, but I'm surely not dumb. Open your eyes. 